Welcome to another adventure or misadventure as the case may be. We're back in the same place as we were last week, but the conditions are very different. Quarter six, we're ready to hit the trail. Mike, are you ready? Yes, I am. Let's try it. Oh, I just saw a pine marten. Blaze isn't sure she wants to get her feet wet. Well, I was not expecting this. There's no snow. So we're a couple miles in, 2.73, and we've got a couple miles left, and it's starting to get a little darker. Blaze found a way to stay out of the snow. Good girl, Blaze. Good girl. We there yet? Almost. Good morning. It's a dark, gray, rainy morning. And I just made coffee, so... good thing is that there is coffee um, but it does not look like a fun day to go hiking I'm strolling out from the lean-to to try to take a look at this river that we would have to cross. Wow. That is a lot of water. It's a little later in the morning and I just came back to look at the, how the river's doing. I think this is a no-go. So it's about noon and this river doesn't look any worse and the sun's coming out. But it's still a little much for me, I think. So I've got the river down there that I'll keep on my left and see if I can find some way to get part way or all the way up Phelps. Well, Blaze found the trail. Girl. So the herd path is really hard to follow, so I've been on and off it. And when I get off it, it's deep snow. When I'm on it, it's sometimes deep snow. Uh, this is what the herd path looks like when I can see it. 
the ice is just melted down to not just one monorail, but two monorails. Hey, 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 what is this? Blue Trail, wow. My first marker this trip. Summit of Phelps. Not much of a view today, but it's got a good breeze. Here's the tracks I made coming up. Should be pretty easy to follow going down. So we're back at this water crossing and trying to figure out if there's a way to get over it this morning so that we can go up yard and big slide. Um, it, the water's level is down a little bit. But it's still pretty fierce. Um, Micah's idea was to pull down a tree that is broken up there and put it over the river, but we were having trouble getting that tree down. Maybe we'll try again today. We're gonna go get our packs and cross this river. Yeah. Here's our new bridge. Built the bridge out of sweat and logs. Well, not too much sweat. It's kind of Mike cold. Mike's idea. Found a fallen tree, dislodged it from above ground because all of the ones on the ground are frozen to the ground. So then we got it down off the tree and we just barely shimmied and lifted it to cross the water. And that's what we're gonna do. All right, let's go get our packs on. Blueberry muffin Lara ball. All right, let's go.
was quite a river crossing. Nice bridge. Not the clean snow we saw last week. Making our way up yard. There's a little bit of icy something in the air. Maybe it's rain, maybe it's sleet. Somebody's house. Making our way from yard to towards Big Slide. Coming up on Big Slide, kind of a surreal summit with snow and blowdown and drift. And pine needles everywhere. Nice gentle snow coming down as we make our way back down yard. I sure hope that the river isn't higher than when we crossed it this morning, because that could mean a tough bushwhack around it.
So this is the last morning we're hiking out, but I wanted to come check the water level on this river before we left. And it's much lower, maybe two feet, 18 inches below the max height we saw two days ago. So this is the other side of the bridge that's out. We came here thinking maybe we could get across this river, but not looking good. <laughs> I was thinking maybe we could wade across this, but... Yeah, why the first wind? <laughs> We couldn't cross, so we're going the long way. Great adventure.